Let's talk about the planet. Super important that we keep it around, right? The way we treat it now will affect generations to come. And our Supreme Court has a big say in whether we can stop the forces causing climate change and dumping toxic pollution into our air and water. Just a few months ago, the court blocked the EPA's Clean Power Plan, going out of its way to thwart a landmark policy for combating climate change. If we're not careful, a future Supreme Court could strike down other critical protections for our climate and environment. And it's not just about stopping big business from polluting our water and air. It's about whether we can set any standards limiting their pollution at all. Ultra-conservative justices are tying the hands of government and environmental groups fighting for our right to a healthy and safe Earth. If big polluters control our court, they'll bend the rules so hard we won't just be headed for a collapse, we'll be speeding it up. But it doesn't have to be this way. Right now, we're at a tipping point. The future of the Supreme Court hangs in the balance. There's already one vacancy, and in the next four years, there could be many more. Presidents serve four-year terms. Supreme Court justices serve for life. Will we have a court that respects the constitutional values of liberty, equality, and justice for all, or one that favors big corporations? Remember, the justices that join the court in the next few years will determine what the Constitution means for the rest of your life. If you care about the planet, access to fair elections, voting rights, then you should care about the future of the Supreme Court. You have a voice. Use it.